to be getting back to normal i'm still experiencing little pains here and there like yesterday i was in like small pains like i wanted to do food shopping but i couldn't because i just i just drove to the shop and i was like my hip is hurting me i cannot walk I decided not to do any food shopping i had a zoom baby shower yesterday it was really nice my friend loved it i'm cooking some lunch Right now, just cooking some rice and ayamashe. Rice cooker, you know. And I got my vision board. I did it last week. Oops, upside down. I've never done a vision board before, you know. I know, right? But I thought in the light, in light of um, doing my challenge, getting to a thousand. It's running out. My memory's running out. Hold on. So in light of me saying I want to get to a thousand subscribers last week, I thought I should do a vision board where I want to go by the end of the year and everything. So I'm just going to show you a quick peek. Obviously, it's a bit personal. It's a bit personal. I'm going to hang it up though. It's like love, growth, pay. 100,000 subscribers, confident, strong. So I want to be more strong, do some courses, generational wealth, la di la da da. So this is pretty much it. It's my vision board. And I so it's it's like one o'clock or something. It's like one thirty. So this morning, the Mega Markle and Oprah interview came out. Um, I watched it. Um, well I watched it on the link and um, basically it's just shocking like I knew to a degree the press didn't like Meghan Markle but I, to a degree the press didn't like Meghan Markle but I didn't know how much it was like damaging her like how much she wasn't seeing like she it was a good thing that she was blocking it away and then to think that she was still blocking it away and she wanted to take her own life is really sad like the fact that Piers Morgan yeah Piers Morgan is such an ignorant I don't even know Buffalo whatever he is like and he's got such a wide voice that no one's shutting this guy up is it for entertainment if it is it for views I don't understand like why is no one shutting him up? It's Women's International Day, so I'm not doing anything. <laughs> she could tell your girl is still in her PJs. But um, just make a match. I'm gonna finish editing a blog so I can put it up for tomorrow. I put did I mention I put up a video and I thought it was completely trash. So hello, hi to all the new guys. I hope you guys are enjoying my vlogs because there's some new people here. Thanks for joining. Thanks for joining the fam. Keep joining. Like, keep like, commenting, and sharing with your friends. I haven't got much to do, but again, I will be vlogging you guys. Any updates about my health? I feel, I feel that I should be able to go back to work next week, but I'll probably work from home for the first two weeks because. Who needs to get the numbers if we want to get that sh bag that sh money then we have to make oh my rice is done <laughs> this is why i shouldn't be at home oh my god auntie zainab we got some caspers I'm not eating chocolate, I had to tell everything on the side. So this is the white chocolate flakes. I've got the Oreo crunch because it's my fave, but we're not eating it. Mmm. 
sorry guys i just wanted to talk to you why i'm in this position right now as you know I've, um, I've been discharged last week last week monday i was in hospital this time last week monday but i'm still experiencing sickle pain so right now i was going through my down my back just taking my tablets um i don't know maybe i have an infection i don't know but usually that's what usually triggers it i look so horrible but we like us sicklers with sickle cell seem to feel like oh it's all over it just comes back and like i know i left the hospital i didn't even left the hospital the doctors wanted me to go to basically to say it was like, are you ready to go home? And to be honest, the hospital can make you feel sicker than sicker than you really are. So like right now, if I was in the hospital right now, I know I'll be feeling this pain 10 times worse. I'm just rambling, but right now, I just wanted to explain like, I'm going through some sickle pain. This sickle pain is like, some people can handle it, some people can't handle it. You know when you first hit or like cut yourself, that's the first surface like oh yeah it's stinging ow da, 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 da. you remember when like it's still healing and then like you get vinegar or something makes it sting again or bleed again imagine that 10 times over imagine fubbing your toe 10 times over i've never been stabbed before but i know it's people have explained because i haven't had a child but people have explained Sickle pain is worse than childbirth. So, obviously, women and f like know the feeling, and like sickle pain, it just takes so long to go away. And like a lot of people don't understand it. This is why I'm documenting it because a lot of people look at my double chin, go, I need to lose weight. It, sh it should be taught in school. I'm gonna do what I can. <sighs> I don't know how much I'm going to do, but I'm going to do what I can and able to do to just give you guys knowledge on what I experience at day to day. Like, I, today I was feeling fine, yeah. Binge eating, you just saw me, like, what, an hour ago, just binge eating. And I, I'm doing all the right things, like, resting, like, a little bit of editing, but it's not major. I'm not doing anything, like, any heavy work, anything, and now I'm experiencing pain. So that's how spontaneous, sporadic it is. It's like, I can feel it in my knees a bit and the pain moves. So I just wanted to explain it to you guys. Like, this disease is not fun and like, it is. it makes me who I am. But sometimes I just feel like I'm just so over this. But every, every person has their own cross to bear. And like, this is, unfortunately, this is mine. And it just humble, like, like it just makes me more humble and like get closer to God because without this my faith wouldn't be as strong as it is because it takes me out from strength to strength every time because it is it gets worse every time so I just wanted to share that with you guys right now I'm not feeling the best look at my tablets so I've timed it I'm gonna start jotting the times because if it gets progressively worse I can take a higher medication higher 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 until until i have to go to hospital but i just for the ambulance use and for the doctors and nurse just to make sure that they're not overdosing me and i'm not overdosing myself i jot down the medication i take i have to take with my medication because it's so strong i have to take an anti-sickness and anti-inflammatory something anti-histamine so that's to prevent me from itching and that's to prevent me from being sick because that's how strong it is like i explained it last week but <sighs> i have a little bit of fear but god is in control that um i won't go into the hospital but i'm trying to remain hopeful but i'm i'm in a lot of bit in a lot oh my god i look huge i don't look flattering but i'm in pain and it's not nice yeah so i just wanted to tell you guys this might be a love another slow week but this is this is my life this is real good morning guys it's tuesday good morning i'm just making myself something to eat i um 
got my food shopping this morning as well at like 6 a.m it's like almost 11 o'clock i just got out of the shower i still feel really really weak like really really weak still joints like joint pain and everything but i wanted to show you what i've got because i know everyone likes a food for um i've got some snacker jacks because lately i've been craving like like biscuits and stuff like that but obviously i'm trying to lose weight so it doesn't make sense oh look sorry i had to change my sd card everything is just getting full so back to my shopping i got um oven pride obviously this is for um one of my cleaners suggested it and we've used it on our clients and it's a great way to bring your ovens back to life we've got um sorry if i sound really slow and stuff because i am really not well like i haven't talked to anyone today at all it's 11 o'clock so yeah i feel like sluggish i feel like going to the day unit but i'm not that ill but it would be good if i can go to the day unit but i don't want them to admit me because it's my sister's birthday tomorrow i've got um off the eaten path so pea bean sticks caramelized and balsamic vinegar these are i've had these before they're nice they're actually nice i know um, what's it called okay i can't fit that in that cupboard i've got some more porridge i've got my guilty pleasure some sweets wine cheese you know i've got some nuts I've got honey roasted nuts though because I'm really trying to not eat too much sugar but I've got bare sugar I've got jelly I got some fruit and veg like but I put it in the fridge early because I've got my soap I've got sugar because I'm running out I did a Tesco shop I've got capsicum some more biscuits custard creams I am craving a lot of biscuits lotus this waffles if you know get to know it's a, i mentioned it i like showed you how i make my sandwiches a couple of weeks ago got some plum tomatoes because i want jollof rice i haven't had jollof rice in ages tomato puree a lime and a lemon i got avocado but it's in the fridge already got tomato i didn't realize that i've left this out what's this a bacon potato a red onion yeah, semi skim milk that's what I got I'm gonna chill today I'm gonna take my medicine in a minute they come in these big bags so when you're lifting it out they charge you 42 for these bags so yeah I got everything but my um, kombucha drink that's it I'm really going to just try to finish editing. I wish I, when I did have the energy yesterday, this is why I always do to myself. When I do have the energy, just edit, like just give my, do that discipline to myself. But, literally, I was, today I'm so tired. If a video doesn't go up, please don't kill me. I'm really struggling right now. Guys, I'm listening to the podcast. Um, they do it on YouTube. It's called The Rap Party. I like their opinions because it feels like it's good to always hear the like, boys' opinions and stuff. Yeah, if, I'll link them below because I enjoy watching them. I actually enjoy watching them. They have a lot, they talk about a lot of topics.
being the greatest but i have to go to my mom's house because it's my little sister's birthday so i'm just wearing some zara trousers i am actually deteriorating right now and it's ridiculous like i am look my eyes are getting yellow i'm worse this is my little sister's birthday i was gonna wrap her gift i was gonna actually go and wrap her gift but to be honest so we just want to I wanted to get it on my camera, mommy. Okay, then you put it down. No, it's already there. So, well, let's cook this stew. Listen, this is sweet. It looks very, very messy, but it's really not. The stew boils over. I mean, she's cooking. Dodo Gizad, if you know, again, you know. She's just put the meat in. I ran to get my camera and she put the meat in already. What are we eating? White rice. So my sister requested white rice and stew for her birthday. So that's what we're going to eat. Also, look a bit crazy. My sister makes cakes and she made a really nice cake. So one's for my sister and one's for her client. Yeah, she's going on. <laughs> what? What? We've got two post sheets going on here. One. Take that rubbish out of my room. I will. Give me a second. And another one. So we're out doing her photo shoot for her cakes. Tell us the details that go into this. <laughs> oh, this looks more creamy. It, it looks pink in the fridge, you know. This chocolate. Oh. She got this. This is my favorite. I can't wait to chow down. Thank you. Oh, so we got what is this? What is this? I can tag you in. Grays in the city. Grays in the city. Look at the label. Oh, it's too small. Where's that? My phone. Oh, this is delicious. Oh, how can I forget my episode? Say hi. Hi. Thanks for tuning in. Follow my page, Grazing the City, on Instagram. It'll be plugged right there. For all your charcuterie boxes, fruit boxes, mm -hmm. grace tables, sweet boxes, everything. Girl, she is the plug. So my mum made me a bonnet. I don't know about this material, but baby. All my bonnets that you see my sister's wearing and stuff. It's for my mum. She's trying to start a new business. And it's reversible, so you've got a uh, muscle cord. This silk material for your good edges. I'm just waiting for my sister to come back so we can <laughs> look at my painter's hat. This is what it looks like a painter's hat. Hideous. But yeah, a uh, muscle cord. I forgot what I was saying. The yeah, is opening, I guess. Happy birthday to my little sister. So that say hi. Hey. Hey, and I'm helping. She keeps saying, she's the one who keeps saying, you in my business. Don't do that. Don't do that. So wait, doesn't it fall down? Oh. Uh, Fuji films you for your Polaroids. Not Polaroids. Pop stop. I've always wanted one. The thing that you put behind your face, look. That's cute. Does that swear away so good? Let me see. How did you carry that? And Dave, I took a cup. Dave, how's the look at this? This is what you take your pictures with. Well, oh, my so you shine, shine, shine. Oh, this fake is. It's not for your phone. It's just like when you're taking pictures, whatever, oh, wherever you're taking pictures. Thank you, thank you so much. It's from Sebeda. Okay, I see. Whoa. 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 <laughs> 
<laughs> I can't see Wait, it from the what screen. Did what did you make? You say that, do you want to drop it on the floor? No, I can't see it. Yeah, we got that. What else? Bad big girl. So, can we move on? I'm down. I need to, and what's it called? I need to see, it's, I'll have to edit all of this. So, ooh, I wonder what this is. I wonder what this is. Ooh, design. What designer? Sunglasses. Mm. Alexander McQueen. Oh my God. <laughs> Ooh, girl. Show us. Put them on. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, oh beautiful. Yeah. You got a picture. Oh my gosh. Oh my they God. are. Nothing, nothing. What did he buy? He said, Okay, now she's opening my gift. Sorry, sorry. Thank you, it was mine. She said it was shit, but you know. Shoes! 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 Oh, this is nice. Oh, this is too short. This is what you want. This is tiny. Have you seen the hill? This is my kind of hill. It is my kind. This is a plum in the link. Cute yeah, very nice. This is very. I will help you wearing. Mommy, mommy wants small heel shoes. So that like you like them high, high, high shoes. I like small heel. Cause I put them long. Sometimes it just looks so like oh. you know, like it don't. No, but isn't just like a size six. Yeah. That's not long. It's for your height. If you look, yeah, not for my height, but if you look long. Who's that from? Anna. Anna, thank you. taking pictures i forgot to bring you guys along forgive me um it was freezing i don't think that was a wise choice considering i'm still feeling sick so i'm gonna take some tablets now and then edit a vlog and take off this makeup i don't know this makeup does not flatter me it was looking nicer earlier but then i don't know Anyways, guys, I'll catch you later. I'll see you when I see you. I made some guac. And I'm going to have some chips with it. There's nothing left. So, I like it from Chipotle. You're just looking up my neck. It's not the best angles, but hey. I usually like from Chipotle. I'm watching Vampire Diaries again. It's been emotional. So, bought these chips, tortilla chips, from Sainsbury's. And now, yeah, I'm going to just chow down with this guac and continue editing. It's not going up today. I felt today. Again. Bear with me. I put my video back up as well because, you know, I said it was trash. I need my content to build up. 
so yeah hey friends hey friends hey friends it's a bit bright here it's bright hi guys okay the sun is moving hi guys it is saturday um it's 12 30. <sighs> look i still got this dead ass car so uh, i feel better but i don't know my body is telling me i am not better girl sit your ass down sit your ass down that's what my body is telling me well i really want to go back to work i really really want to go back to work i need to make some deals i'm going to start answering emails on monday i've decided um ending in all morning i had a worship i went i attended worship live i will link the link below with lola mac always so beautiful always brings me back to center and I, I remember like this time last year did i have i didn't have heavy things on my chest last year but it's just like maybe it's the vlog i'm editing that i feel like i'm very heavy but i'm still wearing my nightgown girl this nightgown <laughs> so um, what's it called? i'm just gonna carry on editing i need to edit two vlogs because i am so behind and i don't like it and yeah i need to get you guys up to speed so i'm gonna and i've got two videos to edit I, i'm so proud of myself even though i wasn't the strongest yesterday but i still recorded two videos and then i think next week i'm gonna record another one obviously pamper session i'm just gonna order some stuff that i need to get and yeah and i took a picture for the gram so make sure you show some love by the time this is out it'll probably by the time this is out it's definitely on the grid so please you know go show some love engagement you know it has been positive it was a bit like a train station but i am um, i'm happy and what's it called i know like the last couple of weeks has been a bit rough and turmoil like it's been rough for myself particularly obviously i had a crisis that i brought you on i had um yeah i just had a crisis and like this is what i had like it stops my whole life like it literally stops the whole life and like i want to get back to life like i want to get back to it and i know i'm not 100 percent better on i should take it easy but time is ticking away like I wonder how, like, if I had kids, how it would be. Because when I have kids, sick like this, obviously, I just have to, like, the ther my therapist says, she said, um, what's it called? Just take one task at a time. Like, if you can't do it, do it another day. Do it in a couple of hours and just take your time. Because the worst thing is sending yourself back into another crisis and then going back into hospital, which is very true. By the way, guys, I don't think I've shown you this. So I've hung up my vision board. I've hung my vision board under, like, on top of my calendar. So it's just to remember why I'm doing this. Like I will see it every day because I look at my calendar every day to see what day it is. I, do you know what? It's funny. I don't have a clock anywhere. Like I really don't have a clock anywhere in my house like <laughs> i really should get one i always wanted one in the kitchen but girl i ain't got no time for it oh my god it's dark okay, so i'm gonna go because i have to fix the settings of this but bye guys thanks for tuning in. this is probably where i'm gonna leave it thanks for tuning in i know this week it was a bit of a slow week but thanks for tuning in i love you guys and Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Share.